Cycling shorts are essential if you want to be comfortable on the bike, but a good quality set of cycling shorts is expensive. So what are you getting for your money and what should you be looking for? The key part of the shorts is actually the pad, and it may look just like a lump of foam, but actually there's a lot of detail goes into a good quality pad. First of all, you'll notice that this one from Santini is pre-shaped so that it actually fits to your body. And when you turn it over, this one's been cut away and you can see just how many different layers there are in it. You've got a top layer of fabric which wicks away sweat and underneath that you've got a layer of perforated foam to allow some ventilation. And below that, in the parts which fit below your seat bones, there's yet more foam and there's also a gel pad. And the whole lot is covered up with another layer of fabric before that's sewn into your shorts. So it's worth spending a bit extra for a pair of shorts with a good quality pad in them. So now we've looked at the pad, let's have a look at the rest of the shorts with the help of my friend here. A pair of summer cycling shorts will typically be made of thin, stretchy lycra fabric. That helps with ventilation and also to wick away sweat. Often the legs of the shorts will be compressive, which helps with blood flow and muscle support and is thought to help with endurance. The other key part of the shorts is the leg gripper. And sometimes they'll have silicone dots to hold the leg in place. But more and more, you'll find a wide gripper like this, which is made of a single layer of fabric. Now, most shorts will come with bibs because they help hold the short in place when you're standing and sitting on the bike. And it also means you don't have elastic around the waist, which can dig into you and become uncomfortable over time. Good quality ones will have flat locked seams so that they're less likely to rub against you while you're riding. The bibs are often made of a lighter mesh fabric to allow more ventilation through the top of the short. You can still get shorts without bibs and very often women's shorts will come without bibs because they're a lot easier for comfort breaks. So we've talked about summer shorts made of thin lycra fabric, but you can also get shorts made out of thicker fabric with a fleece backing, so-called Roubaix fabric. And that helps keep you that bit warmer when the conditions are cooler. The other thing you can find are shorts which will have a waterproof coating, which of course helps if it's raining. And some shorts will be cold black coated, which helps keep the heat down if you're riding in really hot conditions. And a lot of the pro teams now are using shorts with protective layers in them, so that if they do fall off, there's less chance of them getting injured. So we'd recommend looking around for a good quality pair of shorts and choosing a pair which are really going to keep you comfortable over those long miles.